What's up, family? It's Jason here from jasonrobel.com. That's Jason, W-R-O-B as in baby, E-L.com. And I'm here to give you guys an update on my brand new TV show that debuted on Sunday, January 6th on Cooking Channel. So here is the Lolo. So for those of you who have been on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, all over the social media world the past week and a half or so, you may have heard that I have a show on TV called How to Live to 100 on Cooking Channel, which is a pretty fun foodie channel owned by the Food Network. We had our debut this past Sunday, two Sundays ago, uh, January 6th, and the response has been phenomenal. So I wanna personally thank those of you out there who have been following me, retweeting, putting it on Facebook, really getting the word out about the very first superfood longevity plant-based cooking show in TV history. And here's an update, you guys. We had, you ready for this? Are you, are you sitting down wearing clean underwear? The number one highest rated show all of Sunday, January 6th on the cooking channel, the number one show, thanks to you guys. So thank you so much for the continued support. And. I'm here to ask you guys to take it over the top with a few simple steps to make sure this goes to series and we get more plant-based healthy programming on the airwaves. So there are two things we can do to ensure the success of the show going to full series. One is rocking the ratings. So if you guys haven't seen the show yet, check out the links below in the description and click on there to view exclusive online web only clips from the show. There are skits and recipes that haven't been aired on TV that are web exclusive that you guys can check out. Also, the links to the recipes that you can make at home are also in the description, so start there. Plus, if you guys happen to know someone who has a Nielsen box, you know, one of those old school boxes that sit on top of the TV that they actually measure the TV ratings with, if you happen to have an aunt, uncle, cousin, next door neighbor who has a Nielsen box, bribe them with the most amazing vegan chocolate cake you can muster in your kitchen and ask them to tune in and stay watching the program the whole time because each person who has a Nielsen box is worth like, I think, I don't know, 30,000 or 40,000 people. Yeah, serious, serious importance there if you know someone who's got one. Third thing, you guys, if you're on Twitter, be sure to watch the show and send Cooking Channel a tweet. Here's how you do it. You put at cooking channel, that's their handle, at cooking channel, and then you wanna put the hashtag in there, pound, how to live to 100. We've had some confusion on what the exact name of the show is or what the exact hashtag. That's the one you guys wanna use when you're letting the cooking channel know through Twitter how much you love the show and how much you wanna see more of it. So again, it's at cooking channel and pound how to live to 100. Use this one right here and send them as many tweets as you can, letting them know you want it to keep going. So if you go to the website, which is cookingchannel.tv.com, and you search how to live to 100, you can actually leave comments there on the website for how much you love the recipes, how much you love the show, and again, letting them know you want to see more of it. Now, perchance you guys don't have cable, you don't have DirecTV or Dish Network, the cool thing to do, again, is watch those online web clips so you can see the recipes there, you can see how I'm doing these recipes because, let, let's face it, what do we want more of? We want more chocolate kale chips, Ugh, amazing, perfect, healthy snack. We want more longevity recipes like cilantro lime pesto pasta on TV. We want more things like quinoa pine nut marinara bowls. These are just a few of the awesome healthy vegan recipes I'm making on the show. So again, check out these recipes, make them at home, and demand, demand you want more of this, you guys. We have the power. So guys, we're gonna get the big news at the end of the month. Again, the goal here is going to full series. So we have an amazing, place to put all of these recipes and all this superfood nutrition and all these health tips for a mainstream audience, you know? So like housewives in Minnesota are like, oh, you know, 
you know, I heard about those goji berries and I heard about like that gluten-free tortillas and I'm here, I'm looking for them and I'm so glad my supermarket carries them now. Seriously though, it's about creating awareness, education and demand. And this show is a tremendous vehicle for really outreaching to the mainstream, to getting people all over this great country to start eating healthier plant-based foods. So you guys, again, watch the show, check out the air times in January, send the Food Network and Cooking Channel a note, tweet out at Cooking Channel, hashtag how to live to 100, and let's give them the most amazing bombastic feedback ever. And I wanna thank you guys again for my new fans, those of you who've been watching me for years. Thank you so much for the support. Thank you for making this dream come to reality. And let's bring it home. Let's bring it home, the biggest it's ever been. So this is J-Ro, I'm out of here you guys. Thank you so much for all of your support. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and let's rock it harder than it's ever been rocked before. Peaches.